Hello, in this video I am going to show you mouse pointer interactions, I will use it for this small example, where I can use my mouse to click on the cube to print a string and I can also call a hover event to change material of the cube. I want to show you this early on as I am gonna show this in another example in a 5 nights at Freddy's tutorial. First, we go to the player character, you can use box collisions and trigger boxes to enable this at certain points of the game, but I want to use it throughout the whole game, I just use event begin play, and get player controller. I search up set enable click event and set mouse over event. I can then enable these two options. Mouse over is for hovering over actors. I will now compile save, and create an example actor. This actor will just be a cube. I can rename it and do whatever. I will set a base material of red. I will place it in the map, and then start the coding. Unreal already comes with these functions, I just have to call event actor on clicked and on actor begin cursor for hover. It also comes with a cursor end. This is for code for when you stop hovering an actor. Let's start with the hovering, I want it so once you hover a cube, it turns green, and once you stop hovering it turns red. In a future tutorial, I will show it open doors or switch on lights. We can drag out the cube and use a set material node. I will then set the right material. Ok let's test game, as I do, I realize, I forgot to show mouse cursor. So I go back to my character blueprint, and from the get player controller and set show mouse cursor. I enable it and then test game. It works well. I can now show off, the once you click on an actor, it will just print string. Pretty simple like that. But we can do more with it. This event has an input and we can use this to specify a certain mouse button. I will do an equals and select the left mouse button. I can then add a branch, this means it will print a string if I press the left mouse button instead of right. It is hard to see here, as you can't see the cursor or know what button I am currently pressing but hopefully this tutorial was helpful. Consider subscribing and sharing. If you have problems or ideas comment below and see you soon.